Today, I just want to talk briefly with you. I know you're busy at the moment, so I'll talk briefly. About why Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and how we know that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has sent the Quran al-Kareem as the final message for us. And how we know that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has sent the Quran al-Kareem as the final message for us. Or Mbajuizemu Wachi Allah Smart Allah to run it up for adding that it's time it's say by you are the message is say by you a year about to finna. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala describes the Quran inside the Quran as Lisan al Arabiya, an Arabic tongue. Katunda Yogera Kukuran Yoba and Yogera Kunga Gamati, Erimulim in Walaku or Utegere Kanga Rakuya Baba to go not to Kujit again. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has dignified human beings above that of animals by describing the Quran as a tongue. Because human beings are the only are the only part of khulq, are the only part of creation that communicate with our tongues. Animals communicate from where? Their throat. Many prophets والسلام, came before Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and all of them had specific miracles for their own times. Musa alayhi salam came at a time when magic was very prominent. So he had better magic tricks from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And Isa alayhi salam, the messenger before Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, came in a time when the Jews thought they were very good at medicine. This was a time when medicine was the way people had prestige in society. So Isa alayhi salam was given from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala better miracles in the field of medicine. And finally when Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam came, he came in a time when the Arabs were very literate, their, um, their status in society was from poetry. And the linguistic miracle of the Quran al Kareem is something that we can still hold today. Can we still hold today the way Musa alayhi salam turned his staff into a snake? There is only one miracle that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has sent to mankind which we can still hold in our hands today and this is for all mankind and that is the Quran al-Kareem. And Alhamdulillah, this is a message that has united people from all corners of the world. I have been to South America and I have met Muslims there. I have been to Russia and I have met Muslims there. I have come here, Alhamdulillah, to your beautiful country, Uganda. And I have seen so many Muslims here, Alhamdulillah. And I am from a very, very small village in England near the sea. And I found Islam four years ago when I was 16, alhamdulillah. And in England, where I am from, I have only been Muslim for four years and I have seen over a hundred white English people like me enter Islam. Today, 